Hey YouTube, um, so VirtualBox, oops, sorry, VirtualBox does not work, really, it, it doesn't work well, so I'm not going to do that, but I'm not going to be able to show you guys what to actually put into Terminal. So, what's going to wind up happening is you're going to boot, and you're going to open up your Terminal session, and you're going to go sudo apt-git update, okay, then enter. And your password. You're gonna need to be connected to the internet for this, so make sure you have a Wi-Fi connection, because if you just boot it up, your Ethernet won't be working. Okay, so mine's all to date. Of course, everything's already fixed in mine. So you're gonna get this. This is all gonna be grayed out. Okay, um, you're not gonna have the wired connection one setting that I had. What you're gonna have to do is go to Firefox. Well, we're gonna be using this website later, but not right now. You're gonna Google Mythic with an EK Ethernet drivers. Click on the first link, it should be to Ubuntu forums. Click on the link in that page and make sure you scroll up. Go to page one, and you're going to want to put all of this in to a terminal, okay? Um, this will help you out if you're having problems. I don't think it fixed the problem for the guy in the thread, but it worked for me. So, it sucks to be that guy because he can't get Wi-Fi wherever he lives. Uh, who cares, anyways. It should work for you guys, no problem. You're just gonna paste that into terminal. Work fine. Um, you're gonna need a file. I'm calling it Ethernet Cleanup. With all of this information, I'll put everything that is code or script at all in a link in the description for you guys, because I love you. Um, this will basically remove the other driver or make it get rid of the make file and then it'll have you uh, remake the driver around the kernel for your machine so you're gonna run this whenever your machine gets a kernel update okay the next problem you guys are gonna have it's gonna be open GL because they don't have the OpenGL drivers. Actually, I'll do that next. I'll show you how to get hibernate mode in your uh, sh shutdown settings. Right here. Um, and type in really easy. Enable hibernate in Ubuntu 12.04. <coughs> it works for 041 also. Gonna open this up. You can do what this guy says, um, or you can do this. You just copy this part that I have highlighted. Open up a terminal. Oops. Um, one sec. You're gonna type in gk sudo gedit, and then you're gonna type Control Shift V to paste that in there. I have problems with my internet because my ethernet cable is busted. Um, that's why you keep on getting that notification. I'm going to save that there. You're going to paste all this info from this website into there because the file you'll get will be empty. You're going to close it. You're going to hit save. Um, I'm not going to save that because I already have it. don't want mine to break. You're all set. You have Ethernet working and Hibernate working. Unless you have a broken Ethernet cable, of course. Um, I'll have another video which will show you how to get OpenGL because it's a little bit more advanced than this. It's a real pain in the butt to get going, too. Um, make sure you make this cleanup file because if you can't get to the Internet, you need to have that ready to go.
um, that's it for now. Uh, so don't forget to subscribe and go ahead and look at the next video I post up. It'll be how to get OpenGL running for your system. Um, if it's not up yet, subscribe. It'll be up soon, I promise. Anyways, I'll catch up with you guys later.